Morgan would never want me to leave his brother alone. Nurses will be here. I can stay here if you like. What if he wakes up while I'm gone? Michael wakes up and I'm gone. He'll be scared and I can't take that risk. Felt alone. And scared. Even though I knew my parents loved me. Yeah, that's how Morgan feels. Just go home for a while. Give him a hug. Tuck him into bed. Let him know that you're okay. I, I wanted to go home after Michael woke up and then I could tell him the good news. Hey, it'll be good news just seeing you. Morgan needs to know about his brother. And he needs to know about you. Okay? You can't... You can't make him wait any longer, Carly. This is the last place I saw Michael. He was playing a video game and I yelled at him for it and then I went to work. I didn't even kiss him goodbye. It, it, it will provide accurate information eventually. Um, oh, while we wait, might I inquire as to how it fell upon you to name Michael after Mr. Corinthos, sir? It doesn't matter. Well, we can wait in silence if you prefer. After, um... After Carly had Michael, she suffered from postpartum depression. And she couldn't take care of him, so she left him with me, and I I didn't know how to take care of a baby. Well, you must have learned with alacrity. I gradually realized that Michael needed more than food and a safe place to be. You know, he needed love, he needed a, a home parents he needed a name he didn't even didn't have a name so I, I tried to call Carla I couldn't reach her so I made the decision I named him after a man I respected the most a man who was like a father to me what's the point of taking care of a baby giving him a name and surrounding him with love if you can't even keep him safe I'm so sorry that I've been gone so long. I know it's been tough. And you have been such a good boy for Jax, Mercedes, and Grandma Bobby. Where's Michael? Michael is in the hospital. Yeah, see, there was an accident, and he was hurt. So he has to stay in the hospital so his body can rest and heal. And it is. Your brother is getting stronger every day. And that's why I need to be at the hospital, because I really want to be there when he wakes up. And when he wakes up, he's going to come home. And he's going to be so happy to see you. And we're going to be together. We're going to be together. Okay, the plate belongs to a rental agency which also leases cars. To find out who the doctor is. Why would a doctor be involved in I such a heinous no act? Maybe it's a cover-up, but it's a place to start. Even if my highly evolved skills do reveal the evildoer, it won't change what happened to Michael. Hey, I read Morgan's story. 
I tucked him in, so I'm just gonna go back to the hospital. Uh, I was just making some dinner. I thought well, maybe we could eat something together. I've been gone too long. Carly, you really could use some rest. I really wish you were on my side with this. I am, I am on your side. Is it... At some point, you're gonna have to face what the doctors are saying. Don't tell me that my little boy's not gonna wake up. Don't even. Look, I, Elizabeth was in the OR, okay? She said that... Even Since when is Elizabeth a medical expert? She's a nurse. She does what the doctors tell her to do. So why would yes, you go I, to her about my condition? I know that condition? she's a nurse, okay? But Patrick and Robert weren't available to talk to. And I wanted to talk to somebody that was actually in the OR. She watched Patrick remove the bullet from Michael's brain, okay? He's terribly injured. I don't care what Elizabeth said. She's wrong. The trace on the least auto should reveal all we need. You know, this might be a good opportunity for you to eat something, maybe take a nap. At the risk of overstepping, you are not responsible for what happened to Michael, regardless of what Mr. Corintha, sir, might have said in that moment of anger and pain. I put Michael in that life and I helped him stay there. You were working with the best possible information available at the time. Mr. Sir and the Valkyrie, Sonny and Carly are loving parents. This terrible curse They're, doesn't show and Carly are in so much pain they can't even function as parents. They're ripping each other apart. I don't even know how to stop them. Well, why must you be the peacekeeper? I just am, when, Spinelli. When do you get the opportunity to be angry? I wasn't at the warehouse. Okay? I don't want to believe that Sonny saw the rifle and he protected Kate instead of Michael. Do you blame Mr. Corintha, sir, for his unfortunate choice? Sonny made a terrible mistake. Is that what you believe? Yeah. Wow. How's the Valkyrie doing? She keeps telling herself that Michael's gonna wake up. You know, that hope is keeping her alive. Do you believe her? And the doctors are wrong about me. Maybe they're gonna be wrong about Michael. I don't know. I don't want to believe that he's gonna be in that bed for over a while. Oh. At last, the necessary data has surfaced. Is it called these two, Doctor? Indeed. Dr. Ian Devlin. It's fair to lie to Morgan. Or to yourself. But it's fair to use Morgan to bring me home so you can ambush me. I'm just saying at some point we have to make some choices. On your timetable. Or your terms. How do you give up on Michael so easily? How do you Carly, do he's totally unresponsive. And he's going to stay that way. Would you be saying this if he were your child? Or is it easy to say because he's your stepson? That's not fair. That's not fair. You can't keep lashing out at people because they're trying to tell you the truth. You want the truth? You left me for no good reason when I practically begged you to stay. The truth is I had to deal with the surgery, Kate, Sonny, my son in a hospital bed, by myself. Then you go behind my back to Elizabeth of all people. Then you pull me away from Michael under false pretenses. So don't stand here and talk to me about truth, pain, or being a father. the hospital records dr devlin was on call the night michael was shot but his car wasn't reported stolen so uh, maybe someone borrowed it or oh, devlin could be the shooter with a falsified right. time sheet from out why don't you find out everything you can on this guy what he did with football charles where he practiced you hack into his bank accounts i need to find out who ian devlin is doing business with i really am trying to help by giving up on michael i really wish you wouldn't go I really wish that you would come. Why can't you help that my son pulls through this? Why can't you believe that he is tough and he's strong and he's resilient like me? And why do you want me to accept the worst possible outcome when it hasn't even been a week, Jax? I, I, I know if, if you could bring Michael back through sheer force of will and love, you would. But that's not how it works. Okay? I'm just... I can't hurt you by, by supporting your denial. I'm going to the hospital. General Hospital. I'm looking for whoever tried to kill me. Why are you doing this, Sonny? I jacked up the most astonishing information from Dr. Devlin's financial records. Hello, Claudia. Michael? Watch 